Yo everybody, welcome back to another awesome YouTube video. Now today, we are going to be looking at Remnant 2 collector's box and tasting the flavor. Let's get to it. Yo, 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 I hope the day finds everybody wonderful as we deep dive into Mud Tooth Tonic by Remnant 2. G Fuel. Now, this is a flavor I'm super excited about for its own reason of it is a peach iced tea. Now, I've never had G Fuel's peach iced tea, but I have had a lot of people tell me that it is really, really, really good. So, that's what we're going to look at today. So, let's go ahead and take a look at this box real quick. Let's see if we can get this full uh, frame in here. And take a look over here. Uh, this is a game I've never actually played. I think it's uh, Gearbox Publishing and um, Gunfire Games, as I, I do believe the uh, makers of it. But, however, I'm not 100% sure, but this is a pretty sweet, sweet box, I, if I must say so myself. And like I said, on the flavor, I'm super interested in. Let's go ahead and look at the cup. So the cup is something I also have no idea. I don't know nothing about. I just purchased this because of the peach iced tea. This box was like $39.99, whereas the peach iced tea tub was like $35.99. So the whole box was like $4 more. So why not just purchase the box? So I didn't even look at the cup or anything. However, I will say it is a plastic cup. And it is a tall cup. Whoa, and that baby, oh, that is beautiful. Holy smokes. That is beautiful. Like, the artwork. It says unrelenting, unforgiving, unimaginable on the top right there. That's a full wraparound art. Clear on the bottom. If I had to guess, I'm going to say red insert because it's a red top. Yep. 85% of the time, that's how it is. Um, used to be like 90. However, I really, really, really dig this cup. Does anybody else like this cup as much as I do? Like that, it will, like that, I must say, that is an amazing looking cup. What's your favorite cup that's out so far? All right, so now we look at the sticker. Sticker. And I enjoy how simple it is. It's little. It can go anywhere. Um, you can feel the cutout. Like you can feel. No, that's the crease you, you can feel. That's just neat, though. I like the, I like the beautiful cutout stickers. Uh not the normal square ones. I mean, those are pretty cool too, but I like stickers like that. <clears throat> Let's take a look at the tub. The tub, Mud Tooth's Tonic. Now, like I said, peach iced tea. This is a flavor that's been vaulted for a couple years that I know of, and they just brought it back. I didn't want to miss my chance to actually get it, so... Let's get it open and check it out. All right, so we got the seal broke. Let's go ahead and open it up and give it a smell. So this is one of my favorite parts is because once you get a good smell of this, you might know what it tastes like. There's not very many tea flavors also. That's another reason I wanted to get this because there's 160 different, 170 different flavors. I don't know. But there's only like 10 tea flavors, tops. So this is one of the reasons I wanted to get it. That actually smells delicious. It smells clean. It's You can smell the peach and you can smell a little bit of the tea. So let's dig the scooper out right here on top. All right, so the scooper was on top. We had to empty the scooper, and now we fill the scooper again, and I am actually going to use a tall cup. Let's go ahead and get this bad boy filled up and get the lid on it and get it all shaken up nice, and we'll be right back. All right, so it's all nice and shaken up. It's a beautiful red color. 
I didn't know what to expect. I kind of expected a peach oranges color. Uh, the red definitely throws me off, but I'll take it. And uh, yeah, let's see how it uh, how it smells. It's not too strong. Not too strong at all on the smell. All right, cheers, everybody. Oh, okay. So that's real, real smooth, real mellow. I think one of the reasons I like the tea flavors is because tea is made primarily with water. So you don't really notice the powder as much of it being mixed up. Because it's already, I don't know, it, it just blends really smooth and really well. And it goes down really well because I feel like the tea aspect of it definitely makes it more of a water-based powder than if you're putting like watermelon and limeade in something. I don't know. Um, the peach in it is definitely a little, it's a little light, but I almost feel like it might be a 50-50. Hold on, let's see again. So the flavor is really delicious. The peach flavor, I feel like the flavor is light as a whole. I think that's what it is. I think the flavor is light as a whole, like as a whole flavor. It's got really good peach flavor. It's got a really good tea flavor, but it's not like boom in your face. However, I think it's also more hydrating and more appetizing than some other G Fuels. Which is real crazy to say, but again, I think it's because it's a tea flavor. When you get the tea flavor and you mix it with water, you'll understand what I mean. I really enjoy it. So what would I rate this one? I'm thinking of a solid... A seven and a half out of ten. No. No. Eight. An eight. Eight out of ten. It's a super solid flavor. There's nothing wrong with it. It's beautiful. The flavor itself is... I feel like it has everything that it's supposed to have, which is what makes it it. That's what makes it it. You got the peach. You got the iced tea. I think one thing that threw me off is the red in it. So there's only one thing left to do. I got a partner in crime. And she wants to taste test it. We'll be right back. All right. So she's here and she says she wanted to taste it. She said she likes peaches. She said she likes tea. And, I mean, she likes ice, I guess, too, obviously. So. Peaches, ices, and teas. Let's see what she thinks of it. I've already given you my thoughts. Now we shall see what the little princess says. Yeah. No? Not mixed together? Nope. I can't close it. You don't like the peaches and ice and teas? No, I do, but not mixed together. <laughs> so what's wrong with it? What don't you like about it? I like the color. I said, what don't you like about it? Oh. Um, just the flavoring. Just a simple flavor that makes sure you don't think it blends well together. Yeah. See, I, I kind of thought opposite. I kind of thought opposite. But, I mean, to each their own. Then again, if you like tea, you like tea. You know? I mean, do you like tea? And there's that. And then there's all kinds of different flavors of tea. So, but 
That's about it. I mean, like I said, I gave it a solid 8 out of 10. I like the flavor. I think it's there. It's not like super in your face predominant on, uh, you know, like super, super heavy on the taste. Um, she didn't really enjoy it at all. She didn't really enjoy it at all. But to each your own. Everybody take care. Much love. Stay hydrated. Peace. Peace. Cheers.